time to another day, another vlog, miss. In this vlog today, I am going to be doing a hair tutorial with you guys on the Dippity Do products that I bought from TJ Maxx in one of our previous vlogmas. So yeah, I might even do my nails with you guys today because my nails look crazy and I actually want to do them. So um, you're going to be seeing me in this vlog. Uh, well, you see me in all the other vlogs, but it's just going to be me today uh, styling my hair possibly doing my nails we will see but uh yeah let's get into it so i washed my hair with the dippity do uh girls with curls coconut curl co-wash i picked this up from tj maxx it was 5.99 and i really like it i always love a good co-wash and um this one definitely went in um if i if my hair was longer i could definitely see myself being able to detangle with it right now detangling is not much of an issue for me my hands just kind of go straight through my curls I really do not get tangles uh with the length that I have right now um but this made my hair very soft and it did feel moisturized when I rinsed it out I know a lot of you guys aren't a huge fan of coconut this again it's a coconut curl co-wash um but I enjoyed it so for $5.99 not bad it's a good co-wash and then I hadn't deep conditioned in so long, but I didn't feel like, you know, doing the dryer hack and using heat and sitting for like 15, 30 minutes to uh, deep condition my hair today. I just really didn't feel like doing that. So I snatched up the We Dad Curl Immersion, the uh, triple threat deep conditioner with coconut, avocado and grapeseed oil, because this is like a five minute actually it's a two minute it says leave on for two minutes and rinse it out i actually ended up putting it in and leaving it on while i did my makeup and i just rinsed it out so that is uh this is what my curls are looking like right now nice and moisturized and ready for styling so let me slow down i feel it's much more about myself i talk really fast so let me slow down <laughs> so the dippity do stylers i have used both of them twice already um well actually no I've used I've used the the muse the, the muse the mousse a few times. So let me tell you the styles. It's the Dippity Do Girls with Curls, the Curl Boosting Mousse, and there is the Curl Defining Cream. So with my length of hair, I really enjoy a mousse. So I love the way mousse like mousse sculpt my curls and like clump them together. And so I really like a mousse on my length of curls right now so i've been using the mousse i've used it with the leave-in and i've used it by itself um by itself i feel like my next day curls are a little dry so uh i like using a leave-in underneath it which is how i like to use most of my mousses i put a leave-in underneath so i'm going to do that uh today and i'm going to use the mousse today because i did like the mousse better than the curl defining cream to me this was nothing really special i this gave my hair like a cast like almost like it's gel like um it nourishes controls and defines curly hair i would definitely say it did all of those things there's coconut oil shea butter silk amino acids so yeah my my curls were defined they weren't really that shiny like it was okay um yeah it styled my hair you know my curls kind of looked how they always look but they weren't really that shiny and there was a cast um as my hair is growing out i i kind of want less of a cast i kind of want more volume because i think volume is, is all i can really kind of achieve right now because my hair is growing out um and as i'm styling my hair i'll talk about you know what i'm going to be doing with my hair going forward last time i got it cut was in september we are now in december and um yeah it's definitely growing out and it's kind of starting to look a little awkward so i'll let you know what i think i'm going to be doing with my hair but yeah the curl defining cream was okay 5.99 again not bad it was nice i mean for short hair i didn't have to use that much product so if i ever just need like a product to kind of throw in my hair i'll just hey why not the dippity do curl defining cream but nothing to write home about um yeah so today i'm going to be styling with the mousse because i enjoyed that and i'm going to be using the honey's handmade not going bananas detangling conditioner you can use whatever uh leaving conditioner you want to um when i use mousses i tend to use a light deep conditioner so this one is um is light it's not like any like thick defining cream i don't use it like a thick cream and then go in with the mousse like that's not how i use my mousses so i always use like like something that's kind of thin and you know then leave-in conditioner so that is what i'm going to be doing so let's get into it all right so my mirror is here so let's let me get started grab the mousse i don't know why i always shake up the mousse i have no idea why but this mousse says it's a three in one reduces frizz add body and replenishes moisture <laughs> you're being a good boy so i'm gonna do this 
and just kind of just start applying it in. And I just work the product in with my fingers. This is also a great video for people to watch because I get, you know, DMs and stuff like, how do you style your curls? This is how I've been doing it. Just kind of start slapping the product in and then I'll like move it around and do my little part. Um, with my hair growing out, I have been watching different YouTube videos to see how people style their hair. Some people will part it and like curl each curl or twist each curl. Like I don't have the patience for that. So, um, yeah, I don't do any of that. I mean, I try to define certain curls, especially back here. It's the back of my neck that is doing whatever it wants to do. This part right here, like the rest of this part, like this part of my head will be nice and curly and defined. And then this will just be like a poofy mess, probably because I'm always wearing turtlenecks and it rubs up against the back of my neck. So it's just, it looks busted by the end of the day. How this, all of this looks nice. And then this is just like poofy and just basically like scrunched out. And it's, oh, I didn't go in with the leave-in. Oh bust it okay so we're not doing the leave-in today but if you want a little extra something go in with the leave-in wow guys bust it I didn't go in with the leave-in see I get busted when I film by myself <laughs> but yeah so as far as my hair goes um the length it is definitely growing out you guys see it um I want it to grow out a little bit more and then I want to go back to Luvina and have her shape it. I want her to be able to have some hair to work with, you know, to be able to shape it. But one thing about short hair is um, it, it grows fast. And so if you like the short look, you kind of have to keep up with haircuts or else it starts looking awkward. Like I like my hair longer here, shorter here, but it's all starting to even out and so now there's just it's just hair on my head there's there's no defined shape or anything so but I'm willing to kind of settle into this look right now um you know I work from home right now so no one's seeing me except those of you on YouTube <laughs> you know those of you who watch my Instagram but I'm not pressed pressed right now but um yeah i will see yeah these curls like they they go straight into little ringlets they're so long all right so i am trying a new uh edge brush and stuff so i'm gonna finally try the pattern one bought this months ago never used it um so what are we doing We're always eating something so this is the one I typically use, but I'm going to use the pattern one today. This is what it looks like. Let's see if I like it. All right, so I do my little part to part kind of here, um, like this. Guys, I mentioned one time on a Friday Night Live that I tried to watch Hamilton like the Broadway show and I just could not get into it maybe because I tried to watch it with Josh and he doesn't like musicals so I kind of felt the pressure of like oh my gosh this musical is like two and a half hours and he's gonna be sitting here for all this singing and <laughs> and I couldn't even really focus myself like I had to put subtitles on I don't know what they were saying because the whole thing is like rapping and stuff and I just didn't understand what's going on so I watched like 10 minutes of it and I turned it off decided the other night to give it another shot literally and I'm not throwing away my shot oh my God, I have that song stuck in my head anyway watched it and I've definitely watched it like three times again since then like <laughs> so good I'm obsessed with the soundtrack I don't know why I couldn't get into it the first time but I literally had to sit there like focus Taylor focus focus like this is history you love history I love the Revolutionary War you know I know who Alexander Hamilton is and like all the people that they mentioned and all the characters and I was just like come on and uh yeah obsessed completely obsessed so good and I literally have my shots stuck in my head I have my shots stuck in my head I have satisfied stuck in my head I have um wait for it stuck in my head oh I'm obsessed great another musical I'm obsessed with but yeah I had to tell you guys that because you guys were like what like you don't you don't like Hamilton and I was just like no like at first like all the rapping and stuff was throwing me off because I'm like this is this is Broadway like 
I want it to sound more like show tunes ish. But once I like stopped being busted and I actually gave it a shot, I was like, yeah, no, this is really good. Really, really enjoy it. Um, okay, so I always use the Gorilla Gorilla Punk. What is it? Gorilla Gorilla Snot Gel to lay my edges and my part. So this is how I do it. Go in, rub, 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 rub my fingers like this. A little bit on my fingers. Lay my part down. Lay these my edges like that. Like that, like that. I'll tuck this behind my ear I used to do like this little like swoopity swoop on the side I stopped doing that for a while I just kind of tuck this hair behind my ears and then I grab whatever's left and just kind of like I don't even know twist these curls I never know what to do with the curls on the back of my neck because again they're so long they're way too long so just kind of put some got to be on them and hope it does something. All right, let's try this pattern edge brush. So I kind of swoop my hair here. Oh, okay, it's firm. Nice and firm, brand new edge brush. Nothing like a new edge brush. So just kind of like that. And then I'm gonna do this like this. I think I need some more product a little bit more like this da, da, da. Uh, ooh, ah, that was too much oh no okay here we go <laughs> like that oh. sorry trying to focus oh i like this okay this this brush this brush is cute i got it from um from ulta like months ago i don't know if Lorian ever opened hers i bought her one too 12 dollar edge brush yeah. all right that's cute okay so but like see see these like what are these they're just like sticking out in the back i mean maybe if i went through and like really like sat and like define my curls then it would sit differently so I try to like bring this part up now a little bit more you'll notice in my pictures you guys will see like the top of my head uh, on Instagram people are like oh like your curls are so defined I try to make this part longer than this side because this side again is grown out and the, yeah so that is the mousse and stuff in my hair here's what it's looking looking like I keep grabbing like a little bit more just to so like I don't go through curl by curl but if I see some bustedness like I'll use my hands and just kind of work it out and I feel like if your curls are healthy you should be able to kind of like use your hands and like smooth it at least with my short curls I don't know if with my long curls if I was taking my hair and smoothing it if it was gonna be working out but with my shorter hair I just kind of use my hands just kind of smooth it get the curls to be tight um so yeah so this is the hair this is it. Oh, can I see the back? Flip around. <laughs> There's the back. Oh, the sides. Oh, was I at a camera? There. Boom. The side. The side. The front. So I'm going to let this air dry, which is how I let all my washing go basically dry, is air drying. And, uh, uh, Let's see, maybe we'll move on to my nails because I need to do my nails. So let me go grab my nail stuff. Guys, look who oh, oh, goodness. You always tell me about my things, girl. <laughs> oh, it's it's Lorian. Lorian. I, I was came, like, I came by to visit. I'm going to calm down. Everybody, I know everybody gets excited when they see Lorian. <laughs> Guys, I had to take you some fitness. I think it's a fitness. Fitness. So I couldn't be bothered. Don't get a worse out this weekend. Yeah, you were like, go do your hair on camera. I like, love hair. So <laughs> I take one. I take one for the team. I don't even need to be doing mine. But see how quick it's growing back. Oh my gosh! So nice. That's why I was just telling them. Yeah. And I, when you said that, I was like, I was just telling the people on camera. I'm like, the back of the neck has like a mind of its own. It grows mm -hmm. faster. And it starts to bust it. It does. Yeah, it definitely is growing out. But because it's not supposed to be that long, and then mm -hmm. it like it seems like the back of the neck grows out faster. Grow. You mm -hmm. cut mine, I'll cut yours. Girl, I'll put, I'm, I have to just... Uh, and, uh, it was a little on the short side, so mine can grow up just a little bit. It's a little bit. Yeah, so just stop by to say hi. 
Girl, I have a new musical. I was telling the people, because we said it on live one time mm -hmm. and I tried to watch Hamilton. I was like, I couldn't get into it. Okay. Girl, now I've seen it like three times That's so what far. we watched the other night, right? Yeah. Okay. Girl. And so like now all you're going to hear is Hamilton show tunes. Okay. Girl. Yes. So obsessed. Very good. Because I bought in um, the Housewives, uh, the new Housewives of Beverly Hills mm -hmm. the other night. And it was a busted season. No, season four. That's the busted season, I think. So um, I moved past that one, but you were kind of like getting into it. Yeah, it was good. Yes. So. All right. He's so sweet. He's so goodness. He's so, so good. Oh, yeah. Um. So yeah. So what am I doing? So I'm in there tidying up. I've changed probably the sheets on my bed. I um, said we're we're busted because we're 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 vlogging. It's vlogmas, mm -hmm. and we were we were ahead. We were doing good. We were. we were like, but now vlogmas, like the day I'm like, it's right on top of us. I and know. So today we have to post, and today we're filming. This we're busted, but we're go we're gonna get better. We're gonna get better. Always gonna be better. Always gonna be better. Always gonna be better. Well, yeah, I was like, want to say hi to the people. Of course, of course. Let them know course. you're here because, of course, they'll be in the comments like, where's Lorianne? Yeah, and if right? they say, yeah. where's Lorianne? And they didn't get this far in the video because mm -hmm. Lorianne made an appearance. I know. It's just like one of those days. We were going to go live today, but um, I could be bothered with doing my hair and getting dressed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hence the appearance. Hence the appearance. You have bitten to take care of. Mm -hmm. It's bitten to take care of. Oh, sweet. It is sweet. Okay, I'm going to go get my nail stuff so I can do my nails. I don't know how, nails? how much okay. of them I'm going to do on camera because oh my gosh they're looking so busted. Looking mm -hmm. like I don't know. I think I'm going through like a moment because like I stopped biting my nails and then I started again and like I don't know I think it's like a I don't want to say it's an anxiety thing it's a nervous thing like, I don't know yeah, but I started I started biting my nails habit. again which is bad and I stopped like for like two years. Okay. And oh. Then I, then I stopped for a long time and I started again and I feel bad that I started again but I was like no no more. Don't have time to be feeling bad about stuff, girl. Can't <laughs> <laughs> be feeling bad. Hi, baby. What are you looking at? I know. He's so sweet. He's just sweet. He's so good. He is so. He's a big boy now. I'm a big kid now. You are. You're a big boy. You're a big boy. He's so good. All right, guys. So, Lorian. Here I am, guys. Thank you for stopping by. Okay. We appreciate so, it. So, yes. What are we doing tomorrow for Vlogmas? Um, girl. Um, we're gonna figure it out. Okay. We're gonna figure it out. <laughs> I think it's supposed to snow. Is it? It's it's supposed to snow and I actually have to go into work. Ooh, tomorrow? Yeah. Um oh. the fourteenth. I got a thing that one of my absences was like someone put an absence in and then they took it out and they were like, So never mind. I was hoping it was for tomorrow, but it mm -hmm. wasn't. It was for the sixteenth. Oh, and I was okay. like, uh so I have to go in tomorrow. Alright. So that is that. But uh okay. Alright. Thanks for stopping by. Good, Good to see you. Good to see me. Alright. <laughs> Okay, so here's my little busted nail station. I am no professional. I only am learning from uh, TikTok and YouTube and uh, yeah, so still learning. But I picked up um, this bag off Amazon. This is the brand and they are fake nails. And because obviously a girl don't have any nails. So I put these fake ones on and um, they come in nine different sizes. So I've already sized my nails and I am going to now glue them on with this KISS Maximum Speed Nail Glue. So my nails are already filed. I used, got this from TJ Maxx, this uh, Onyx Professional. It's acetone to dehydrate uh, my nail bed because they say it helps it stick better. And I also kind of roughed it up a bit as well. I haven't done much to my cuticles I'm still learning how to do that and I'm not trying to chop my cuticles all up not to mention mine aren't that bad so I don't even see what I'm supposed to be chopping off anyway are on Ta -da! and I always try to get into round nails but I'm definitely more of a square nail person so I'm going to shape them into square okay so these are my nails all shaped and now is the painting part I'm going to go in with a let me see it's like a what color is this 
it's called little toto and so so awesome a company called madam glam sent us some gel nail polishes so madam glam and they sent little toto which is like this creamy color they sent all the way up which is like this mauve color basically kind of like this color like mauvey and then there is behind the scenes which is like this navy blue so pretty and then there is sapphire city which is like the navy blue color but it has glitter in it and um, definitely check out their website for their uh, gel nail polishes they are so pigmented and they are just beautiful they have so many colors use code madcurls30 to save 30 percent on their website that is such a great deal 30 percent off with our code and i am going to take the cream color little toto and paint my nails they also sent over their uv light mini uv lead lamp so i am going to use that let's do it okay guys my hair is done my nails are done again check out madam glam i typically order my gel polishes from amazon but i always have to do like three or kind of four coats for them to become opaque but this i did two coats of it i probably could have gotten away with even just one but i did two coats and i really love the madam glam gel polishes because they are super pigmented nice long lasting and um yeah so thank you so much madam glam for sending us some polishes to try and again and our macros code is macros30 you can save 30 percent off their website uh at checkout so definitely check them out so many colors so many options some even like themes they have like different themes like collections with themes so cute love it so much okay the hair my hair is dry here it is curls look good again like i like it i like dippity doo i think it's cute it's pink um it's actually it's, well, it's pink and turquoise and i love turquoise love the color turquoise like they're cute they're adorable they're a nice addition to the collection is it anything i'm jumping out the window for no but it gets the job done it gets the job done for 5.99 they know they're inexpensive um i believe you can order them off walmart.com too like they're they get the job done they're cute so my hair feels good looks good curls are good everything's good um i like it the smell actually you know did i mention the smell they smell good too let me see yeah it smells like strawberries to me this collection smells like strawberries um but yeah very cute so if you happen to come across them at tj maxx or marshall's or i'm um, even if you want to order from walmart i'd say go for it you know why not nice little inexpensive line cute pink and the products weren't good so that is my review of dippity do again here are the results oh, doggy you always want attention boo boo he doesn't like when i do my nails he wants to get all into all my nail stuff okay 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 all right oh we're sleepy oh we're sleepy so guys thank you so much for watching this video this vlog miss comment down below if you've ever tried uh dippity do or if you tried madam glam if you, let me know do you guys do your own nails to go get your nails done are you into nails let me know and just drop a comment chat in the comments and uh thank you so much for watching and i will see you in our next video bye you silly boy you silly you silly you silly you always want attention you always want attention you can't have my lipstick you can't have my lipstick